Center Strain Zero One back at you with more Tomb Raider. We're ready to get into this. It is Friday night, and I'm going to be playing this game all night. So you can have lots of videos, uh, as well as I'll be playing Saturday. I got to work on Saturday, but I will be still putting videos out. And then, of course, I have Sunday off, which means lots of videos on that day as well. So this is going to be a great weekend for Tomb Raider, and hopefully we're going to be able to finish this guy up. Or should I say this girl up? And uh, hopefully we can have lots of fun as well. So let's keep going. Just when I thought things couldn't get any worse. What were those things in the monastery? They were dressed like the storm guard and the sounds they made almost inhuman. Shit, just listen to yourself, Lara. You sound like Dad. It's like they're the remnants of some lost civilization. Okay, now I really sound like Dad. All I know is they killed those men, and I have a feeling they wouldn't hesitate to kill me too. But I can't think about this now. Sam's in trouble, and I've got to get her back. She's counting on me. All right, so there's not really anything that we need right now, but we're going to see what uh, we can do. Maybe we have enough for some stuff here. Uh, anything to make it more powerful. Firing rate. Increased damage. There we go. Yeah, because once we get in firefights, then there's no reason to be stealthy. So, you know, that'll really come in handy. Shotgun pretty much takes, takes care of them. Alright, so it's given me a couple of different options. It's always a challenge to figure out which way that I want to go. Because I know I could go this way. As you can see. But then there's that other way up there, which it looks like that's the way that I want to go if I want to follow um, the course of action. But since, you know, we're an explorer. Okay, oh, that scared the shit out of me. I thought I had, I thought I had my bow equipped. That really did scare me. All right, so let's see what's going on this way. You want out of here? There's a clip. Go ahead and jump. Now let me finish this bottle in peace. All right, so I'm not really sure if we got a really, really good chance of being stealthy here. Probably as soon as we fire on this guy, they're going to know something's up. But I definitely want to fire on this guy since he has the flammable thing on his back. Oh, we can do it that way. And take all them bitches out. Because that's how we roll. Alright. What's over here? Ah, yes. We are an explorer. I hate that. Every single time I do that, 
I always, uh, I hold down the X button. I just gotta press it. I remember that string. I'm tired of getting that damn thing out every time. Okay, so... I've lit that on fire. It's got a rope so I can pull it. I'm going to assume that if I pull it from this direction, it'll be able to knock it into there. Okay. And then the other assumption means I need to pull it from this direction. Which would be to knock it into here. And it missed. Did you see that? You can do that a little better. Oh, we're failing miserably. I guess I gotta wait until it stops now. I need to get right in that sweet spot. Wait for it. Yes! All that for some salvage, huh? See the kind of explorer we are, ladies and gents. This is what we do. Find everything we can. Let's see, do we got a uh, location of anything else in this area? There's a GPS catch right here. Let's see if we can find out where this is. Right next to us. Alright, anything else in this area? Well, there's something right there. Ah, it's up there. I missed it. So I gotta get back up there. Okay. We're gonna, like I said, you know, <laughs> I'm as thorough as can be. We're gonna find everything we can. Nothing's gonna stop that. Especially since all the comments that I've gotten from um, all of you that love the fact that I'm actually going and getting the most out of this game and looking for all the little stuff, you know. I could've pro probably already been done with this section, you know, seven, eight minutes ago, but the fact is, you know, I'm searching continually and I'm not gonna stop. It's a shame we didn't see that the first time, though. All right, anything else in this area? Uh, right here, no. Hey guys, haven't seen you in a while. The guy must have fell. All right, looks to be good. All right, let's keep going. I see you. Alright, so let's find out where we are now and see if there's any other collectibles in the area. Uh, since we're still in the same area where we had the last, whatever you call it, cave, that's why it's pretty much telling us uh, that there's stuff around here. So, obviously there is a document inside that we're probably easily going to find as soon as we get in here. Just need to equip our shoddy. Sam, are you okay? What do they want with me, Laura? A fire ritual? This is so fucked up. Listen, I'm coming to get you. I'm going to get you out of there. Please, please help me, Laura. I promise. I promise, Sam. Hey! Oh no! Sam! <gasps> Sam! <gasps>
at how that just seamlessly puts it right into there. Alright, so it's above us. That is just so awesome. <laughs> I keep doing it. I want for nothing now. As a priestess of the Sun Queen, I stand above all others in her court. I'm being instructed in languages, etiquette, history, warfare, all the skills needed to rule. And the Queen has been like a mother to me. Warm, attentive, loving. But it all feels false like some kind of performance. When I talk to the other priestesses, I sense disquiet. Some of them feel as I do. Perhaps all of them. But why? What is it that we all fear? All right. Anything else in the area? We might be in a new area, so there might not be anything. Yeah, we're pretty much leaving this area, so we didn't do too bad. Uh, we found a lot of stuff without having to go, you know, kind of too far back during the playthrough. See, I keep doing it. I'll go check it out. Nothing here. Whoa, Pedro, the tank's full. We need something to hold it. <laughs> Holy shit. Oh, that was awesome. Man, you gotta be fast on the skills, man. This shit comes at you out of nowhere. I mean, I've gotten used to usually when a cutscene happens like that, you see her falling. You know you're gonna have to hit that X button to make sure that you stay up there. But that was pretty sweet. So, which way am I going to go? Stay alert. We'll check it out. Come on. Something's up. Oh, wow. We bypassed those guys. I'm not sure if I can jump to there without being caught. Huh? Oh, oh well, let me get lower. Let's see, they're right below us. But I just can't get a spot on him. I'm in position. Oh, 
All right. We still remain rather stealthy, so I'm, I'm very happy with that. I'm not really sure how I would have been able to do that any stealthier than that, really. I want to get in here and see if there's anything that I missed because of the way that I went. Ah, what is this here, though? Look at that. Ah, why didn't I do that? See, that's what happens when you come this way. But let's just see what it would have done anyways. I would have killed him. We'll go back this way just to see if there's anything that we could have picked up along this little route. Nope. Alrighty. Let's keep going. I think I actually saw this part. This is like a part of, from a demo or something. No, this doesn't look good. Holy shit, what the fuck? Holy crap. Couldn't see in front of me. Holy crap, I can barely see. Holy crap. Holy shit. Oh my gosh. We should no freaking trees. Oh wow, we made it. Kind of. 